But hello, my husbands. It's so good to be with y'all again. How y'all doing today? Okay, now all my new ones coming in, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, that notification bell, ding dong, ding dong. Also, comment, share, and like. I'm still waiting for some vodka recipes as well. Let's say prayers, and I'll tell you what we're eating tonight. Father God, thank you for this beautiful blessing and awesome day. Let this seafood be nourishment to my beautiful and healthy body. For the look of uh, the lookovers that's coming here, bless them in the same. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen and uh, amen. Thank you. Now, uh, the cocktail, I'm telling y'all, I'm loving the vodka with the cherry and the lime. I, I'm, I'm really thinking that cherry juice is going to be my, my main squeeze. <laughs> mm. That is so good. I didn't do the toast. Here's a toast to my new subscribers. Welcome in the family. Come on in. Take a seat. Bring your cocktail, your Kool-Aid, or your water. Bring your food, your snacks. And let's get ready for my life, my story. Let's get ready. Thank you for being here. Oh, clink, clink. That's it, y'all. So we have cucumbers. We have some more of a, a black denim sauce. It was so good. I'm, I'm laying hold to try to get some of B-Love, Smackalicious, and Flavors by Dame Dash. His as well. Mm. Mm. Oh, oh, here you go, y'all. Got to take a fresh bite. Mm. Let's get some onion. Oh, look at that. Mm, 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 mm. Mm, 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 that's so good. This sauce really is good, y'all. Take a bite. Mm. It's good. Oh, oh, and I have, oh, I'm sorry, y'all just eating. I have white potatoes, of course, the shrimp, and I have some more blue crab. Uh, yes. Okay, where did I leave off? Oh, that man. That climbed in that tree after me, y'all. That's where I left off. I'm tell y'all, I was getting out the car for the person who picked me up, and uh, it was just a person. Oh, and I got lemon, y'all, that I was talking to. Nothing, no more than that. No more than that, y'all. Mm. I got up half the driveway. Oh, that's hot. All I remember at that moment. Mm. Was this hard body falling on me, y'all, from, from the tree? I remember hitting that concrete, and I ain't remember nothing else. That man fell so hard on me off that tree. I don't remember anything else. I remember... Waking up in the hospital because the, the uh, man in the house, of course, I told y'all his brother was living there too, saw it. 
I woke up in that hospital yard. I didn't even know who I was. He beat me up so bad. My God, my face was just in a mess. I had a concussion. Cause I hit that, I hit that uh, driveway concrete. That was, and that is something I'll never forget. And so, you know, even today, all these years later, I always look up at them trees, y'all. <laughs> when it's dark outside, I do not even walk under a tree. I stayed in the hospital a few days. But y'all know I sent his behind the jail. He did go to jail. It just made me more conscious of my surroundings. It did put a fear in me as well. And I was like, you know, how coward was he? Knowing that, you know, I was going to hit him back. I was going to pick up something like I did with that hoe. I think he knew that. And I think that's why he did that coward thing and uh, went up in the tree. Boo. A true fool. Mm -hmm. That's exactly what he was. I moved away quick. While he was gone, I had to leave Green Park. Because if I didn't, we was going to kill each other. He was defeated that I would never come back to him. He, he was mad that, you know, men cannot take rejection, you know? Women, we can almost take anything that life throws at us. Men, on the other hand, they can't take it. He could not take that rejection, y'all, because he knew I was a good woman as well. I always been a good girl. Mm. Y'all, I'm going to tell y'all, if I have to say a thousand times again, black denim sauce is really, really good. Shoot it. If his sauce, if his sauce is like this and everybody rapping and raving them on Smackalicious sauce, Lord, I may need a doctor. <laughs> so, y'all, anyway, I moved. And I also knew that when he got out, he was going to try to find me. So I ducked and I dodged for a long time in my life, y'all. Then... I heard and got word that he got out, but he got us in trouble with them drugs, y'all. So, I was struggling with my finances again, so I felt it was safe to go back to Galena Park. Because that man said I would always have a room there because... You know, I was a good person. Well, when I went back, his brother was there. I was in my room, y'all. My baby was asleep.
I'm sorry, y'all. Excuse me. I have to get my um, cutters for the crab. So, while the man of the house who owned the house was uh, gone, he was at work. He had his own business as well. Uh, he used to do a lot of work for the Ship Channel something, y'all. Oh, that's my Honey, his brother had the nerve to come in my room. He didn't know the beast I had become in them streets. He called himself trying to rape me. I was like, oh God, I, you know, I already had to came a beast from all that other stuff, y'all, when I was in the street. It was a glass base. Sit on top of the bedside table. It's a nice size base. He had stitches. He got some stitches. See, he didn't know that part of me that out of all the times at 13, 14, and 15 that I heard the fight, I got whooped. The men thought they could do what they did to me. Hmm. He had to get the other side of it, y'all. How about that? He had to get that old ugly side of this hood, girl. Because I was a fighter then. I had and not just a fighter to fight, but a fight to protect me. I did. I took that face up beside that head. I had to call 911 because it did bust his skull. But I nothing happened to me, y'all, because I was defending myself. It was rape. Or attempted rape. I'll say that because he didn't, he didn't get to rape me. His children, he called his children, y'all, I guess when he was in the hospital. I think it was a, a girl and a boy. They came over there. He didn't tell them what they did, what he, what he, he didn't tell them what he was trying to do to me and why he ended up from stitches in his damn head. They came over there. Trying to beat me up, y'all. They too did not know that beast that was inside that hood, girl. I became a beast to protect myself. They didn't even know that I had that beast in me. Okay. Hmm. I 
think they saw that rage. And after I told them, you try to rape me, I'll kill you. They didn't know that. He tried to attempt to rape me. But they saw that rage, y'all. I don't know what the rage looked like. But I knew I felt that ugliness come out of me. To say, come on, mother sucker. You want some of this? You can get some of this hood, girl. Put your hands on me if you want to. I, I want you to. I want you to. I want you to hit me. I'm actually going to let you hit me because I'm easily bruised. <laughs> hit me, fool. So when I knock your ass out with anything I can pick up, pick up it's going to be self-defense. <laughs> I learned that too, y'all. So hit me if you want to. They didn't. It was a girl in the bar. They didn't. Neither, not neither one of them. So when the guy got home, I told him what his brother was trying to do to me. He, he, he put him out. He told him, you can't do that. You, you can't put hands on her. She's a guest in my house, just like I gave you a place to stay. He said, you got to go. I won't have that in my residence. Yeah, not long. So something happened. I, I have to keep this private because it would hurt others. The next part, it would really hurt other people. So I, I, I can't say what happened next. That I have to go to my grave with, you guys. I'm sorry. Some things you have to go to your grave with. So I start seeing another guy. But he was a roughneck. <laughs> I was like, since I'm trying to, you know, all these good guys and they turning out to be fools, I'm going to give a roughneck. The blue crab is good, y'all. Oh, let me stop right there. Tasha. With Steph and Tosh. Girl, you had them blue crabs the other day. You said somebody wanted to teach you how to eat them. You told all right. Girl, you wasted a lot of crab over there. I mean, it's more sucking than what you do to your snow crab, but you got to get that clean like that. Ain't nothing in there, but but the seasoning. You see that seasoning down and out? That's all it is. Girl. <laughs> That's that Greek seasoning. That's that Greek seasoning, too. So, I'm going to tell y'all. He got put out. I started seeing a rough neck. But for a very short time. It wasn't my cup of tea. I think that's why today I still love that suited man, you know. Gotta have liver. I gotta have I love him to be suited, but um, you know, just one side of him gotta have some kind of roughish though, you know, because that's what I like. I like that roughage. Just a little bit, though. Not all of it. So, um, I stayed in Galena Park just a little bit longer. I had the baby. And I have to say, I, I took a break from school. Because I needed to. 
until I found out I just found that somebody can watch my baby. I really didn't want to take it down, take my baby down to his father's parents' house because I ain't know if they was gonna to try to keep my child. So I was already had a little. Oh, I forgot about this. Mm, I forget. I already had that vengeance inside of me. Mm. I had that business. So I was like, uh-uh. Because if he got out of jail, they wouldn't tell me. Then I would have to fight for my baby. So anyway, some months passed. I'm I'm good. All of a sudden, I had just got through cooking. I didn't even know he had got out, right? So a knock came on the door. It was him, his mother, and one of his brothers. So the man in the house said, I don't want no SHIT in my house, but come on in and take a seat. And he said, I suppose y'all here to see Juanita. And they were. And a couple of my friends were there. I was standing behind the bar. It was, we, had a, we had a bar in the house. They trying to tell me what I can and can I do with my son. I spit that baby out. Yeah, he's a part of you. You played a part. But he mine. I got sole custody, fool. His mama started, yeah, 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 girl, you better get out of here because you didn't have that baby. You the grandmother. Not the mother. And mother. And not the mother. So he gonna come to the bar. And he got me on my side and, and did one of them pinches. Oh Lord. You about to get this bar glass stuck up in your... I got to watch my language on here. Boy, if you don't get your hands off me, it's going to be some bloodshed up in here. And I don't think that's what y'all came here for. But it, and, I, and I gritted my teeth too, y'all. But then my friend girl who was there, she saw it. She said, you, you better get your hands off of her. And she said, that's her, baby. Get your hands off her. Y'all can't come down here. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was good. Mm. It's good, y'all. She said, y'all can't come down here trying to tell this woman what to do with her baby. Y'all live down the street. Take y'all ass home. That's what the girl, that's what my friend said to his mama and them. <laughs> and I was already gritting my teeth telling this sucker, you better get your hands off me. I ain't telling my what, but he didn't know that that uh, bar glass was going to be up his behind. Do I one more breathing moment to get your hands up off me? For real. He did. I think I put that scare in him too. I was like, damn. Every time I think I'm going up onto another level, you know, something that's the struggles, y'all. Those are those obstacles that kept trying to just keep me at bay. And I'm thinking like, uh-uh. No, 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 no. I got so much more to tell y'all, but I got to stop right there. Thank you so much for coming back. Thank you for having your cocktail with me, eating with me as well. So, so anybody else who signed on and saw me and you came to see this, then I just say, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, that notification bell. So every time I post a video, you are going to get it. Don't forget to comment, share, and like. Thank you so much for coming to my family space. I love it. And I need y'all as well. So thank you. And I love you. And you can't do anything about it. Have a great night, my good, beautiful people.
Bye-bye.